Welcome back, casters, to the channel. I'm Mark, and today, guys, I'm going to help you all become better gamers. Now, today, guys, we have a slight uh, discussion video about some events that I'll be hosting, some stuff, and uh, the decks that I've been building, guys, because yesterday, I went down to my local game store, Multiverse Games, got some sleeves, we got some cards, opened some packs and stuff, and uh, we're going to be... We're going to be building some decks, baby. All right, guys. So we're over here at the mat. Uh, this is the Multiverse Games mat. And uh, yeah, so the first thing that I actually finished building is I made a legal copy, legal version of uh, Fearsome Critters. I know uh, <laughs> Enoch yesterday caught me playing Six Lightning in a Bottles at Locals. <laughs> we're just playing casually. And like he ran through my deck. I was like, no shot. I'm not playing Six Bottles. And I was... So I'm a silly goose. <laughs> just, I'm just making illegal deck comps, you know? Uh, that's all it is, really. Um, have that. I also built... Uh, what is this? A... Cosmic deck. Uh, shout out to Mikey for actually giving me some of these full hollows. Oh, baby. Um, some of these, they're cute as fuck, dude. Oh, my God. I love it. Look, look at that. That's crazy. Um, but, yeah, just basic cosmic. Also got a supernatural black hole in there. Hollow. And uh, yeah, this deck is, I think, pretty solid. I'm not playing the lock because I think it's kind of sus sometimes. Sometimes I'd rather just actually flood the board and play a game for real, you know, as opposed to calling BCs and then losing my card to a spell. So that's just me. Uh, you know, I'm trying that out. Playing stars in there as well. I feel like that's a decent little thing. And those are people who are strong enough for me to win games off of that alone, I think, really. Um, anything else? These are just some random cards that I had. I also was building my Lightning Forest deck. If you guys have played against me recently, you know that I've been building a Lightning Forest deck. Because I feel like it's really good. Lightning Forest as in... Not that one. This is my water deck. Uh, but, like, Lightning Forest is in, like, playing Wood Devil, Gumbaroos, you know growth and spiderlings so i feel like that's a pretty solid deck but i feel like i'm the only one trying to check it out if you guys want to try it let me you know let me know let me know but uh this is the metal man deck or the lightning forest deck i'm playing spiderlings metal man of alabama because with tinfoil is a one one m cats got the caster cup cats for the jersey uh, Wood Devil, one Gumbaru, an Ackler. And, I mean, it's it's pretty standard outside of, like, the few neutral cards and Spatterlings that I have. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. And, uh, hey, Dragon Shield, if y'all want to sponsor me, you know? Hey, you already know, baby. Uh, here's my water deck. This is something that I've been trying to mess around with. I'm playing Gisabusco, but... Honestly, <laughs> I might just not even play this deck. I mean, I have every card, but I'm just like, I don't really want to play this deck. Honestly, I feel like I'm not the right player to play it. Uh, one of my local guys, Antonio, is just very godly with this deck. He does very well. And I don't know. I don't get it. It feels like this deck is the same as it was in Crypto Nation, really. The only addition was it got a flyer. And that's pretty much it. Uh, what else did I have? I had one more, like, pretty much complete deck. No, two more complete decks. Uh, this is my Frostworms. Uh, the only thing this has a tough matchup against is exactly the mirror match. And, you know, it came up once. I was playing against, uh, Martin. And, yeah, it was kind of tough because Ami Cooken just hit my Frostworm. And that's really sus, honestly, if I'm being fully honest. And I think I actually took out the Frostworms because I sighted them and I just never put them back. But I do have a full play set of sparkly Ice Worms now, so I can play that. That's really cool. My deck is also almost completely blinged out, which is pretty nice as well. Um, I've been... Ice is one of those aura types that I've just had an affinity towards. And I, I felt like blinging it out, you know? I think it's, I think it's a pretty cool deck. And then for the fire deck, guys, I'm not entirely set on stone on what I want to play in here because I'm not really a fire player. I 
I know Enoch is a fire player. I have a few people who play fire in my area, but I'm just, I don't really know what I'd want to play. If I would want to make Gassies, Morpheuses, and Scorched Earths, or Scorched Fires, Scorched Pages, excuse me. <laughs> but, you know, I feel like I'd have to play test it a little bit and just see what I like. Playing the Absorboras, Coal Miners, Sam, because you already know Sam's kind of goaded. Uh, I am trying out a Patient Insight. I saw one of the deck lists by the Dueling Bros, and I was like, oh, that's weird. Y'all aren't playing um, the growth kind of Kryptonation thing. And, you know, it's probably a consistency issue, you know? Uh, there's a lot of times where you end up just getting Kryptonation, no growth, no Uncle Sam, no Gassy, and you'll just end up losing because you just have a dead card that doesn't really facilitate anything outside of exactly like four cards in the deck. And that's kind of an issue. But, uh, one more thing. Shout out to Mikey at Multiverse, guys. I love you. Mikey S. Dog, you're goaded. He actually gave me a, uh, if I can pull this out, he gave me a My Hero deck to try out. Uh, I've been looking to play another card game as well, just because I have extra time right now. Because I'm off for the semester, and he got me a, uh, Zuku Midoriya. Little, little structure deck that I can play with and learn the card game with. Um, overall, I do like my hero. I think it's a kind of cool card game. I know how to play it mostly. I'm just confused on the combat. And I'll be honest, guys, I do actually read the manga or I've read it before. I caught caught up to the point where I think it was chapter 300 something. And then I just dropped it because I was like, I don't really feel like it anymore. Because after so many chapters, you just want to drop something. And it's just like a structure deck, but I want to learn how to play the card game just so I have another locals I can go to. Um, I've also been like judging a lot and TOing a lot, so I don't play MetaZoo as often as I would like physically, like in a tournament setting. Um, I'm going to be hosting, or not hosting, I'm going to be judging the uh, Argos Anonymous tournament that's happening in the multiverse. I'll go and, actually, yeah, I'll go and post up a picture right now if uh, if I remember. But I'm hosting that one on January 7th. And, or, I, keep, I keep saying hosting. I'm judging that one on January 7th. And uh, I think it's going to go pretty well. You know, uh, Fossil's really doing his best to make the event a good experience. And I think it's going to be great. I think it's been a good time. Uh, outside of that, I think I had... Do I have my artifact deck on me? I have some extra My Hero cards. I have my Girl Mountain Lady. Oh, baby. I pulled her and I was like, dog, I didn't know you were in the card game. Mount Lady's kind of, whew, you know, she's, she's something. She's something. She's something. I don't remember where I had my artifact stuff. I was building the artifact deck that I saw at the caster's uh, tabletop tournament. And um, I have the Sam Scarfs. I have the Light Elementals. More Sam Scarfs. Scarecrows. Scorecrows, I think, are kind of good. Just the fact that it can search for itself. And the fact that it also basically has tribal boost with the arena effect. I think that's kind of kind of funny, honestly. <laughs> I think that's really funny. And uh that's like an it's like an OTK deck that plays it in the there's this one card that says Let There Be Life. And you can turn all the artifacts into BCs with a uh, 30 attack, which is you know, is it janky? Maybe, but it looks like it's going to be fun. So I'll probably try building that one of these days and we'll see about that. I also have a dark deck, but I don't really have it built, honestly. Dark, I think, is a decent aura type. I just don't like playing the Nappa sometimes because Nappa just dies to Kets. And that's a big problem. I feel like Kets is probably a terrible matchup for it and Kets is something that you're gonna see a lot if you enter a big tournament so that's kind of an issue for me um but yeah guys hopefully you enjoyed the video I was just talking about the decks I'm building and you know my hero um yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed and I'll see y'all later goodbye